Well, hello everybody. Welcome to my bathroom. So this weekend we turn back the clocks. So we turn back time uh, on Saturday night. Can you believe that's happening already? I like that we get another hour of sleep, but I don't like that it gets dark so early. How about you? So anyway, I thought it would be the perfect time to talk about turning back the hands of time. And so I wanted to show you guys my exact nighttime skincare routine. So I'm gonna walk you through it start to finish. And um, before I do that, I'm going to tell you that we are using the TimeWise Repair Set. And that's what I call the super duper anti-aging. So if you really wanna turn back the hands of time, this set is amazing. Okay, so. Uh, feel free to ask me any questions, whether you're watching this in replay or you're catching this live, you know, about any of the products that I'm, I have used. So what I already did is two things that I wanted to share with you. And that is I already took my eye makeup off using the oil-free eye makeup remover. So I just squirted on a cotton pad, took my eye makeup off. The second thing that I did is I used the micellar water to take off my foundation so that I could get a thorough clean, okay? So I've already done that. So we are just gonna jump right in and I am going to show you my nighttime skincare routine. Okay, so the first thing that I do is I like to wet my face and we're going to use the Skin Vigorate brush. So the Skin Vigorate brush is amazing because it um, cleans your skin four times better than just using your fingers or a washcloth. So what happens is it really gets in and, and cleans out those pores. So we're gonna use the Skin Vigorate brush and we're gonna use our TimeWise Repair Cleanser. I love this cleanser so much and a little tiny bit goes a long way. So I'm gonna make sure that the head of that Skin Vigorate brush is wet. I'm gonna put like just a little dot of cleanser. That's what that looks like. And then I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse my face, okay. So here we go. So what I love about this brush is it has two speeds. I use the slowest speed and it's automatically turns off in a minute. Now I probably won't wait the full minute just because, you know, we're uh, for time purposes, but you can hear the sonication of that. So it's vibrating and the sonic system really cleans out your skin. And so I just make sure I get all areas and I do avoid my eye area but I'm cleansing that skin with that brush. So it's thoroughly cleaning, okay? Now normally it would just turn off itself, but I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off. And you can see even after I took the micellar water, all of that dirt left is, is coming out on the brush. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna rinse that brush and I'm gonna rinse my face. So hold on for one second while I do that. So I just make sure that I get all that cleanser off and then I'm just gonna pat dry my skin. Okay, oh, I love that feeling of cleansed face. So you can see, like I've got some redness in my face. I'm not sure it's rosacea, just a little bit of redness. Okay, oh, feels so good. All right, so here we go. So that is the first thing I do. Now let me talk a little bit about these boosters. You guys know I love these boosters. These boosters are amazing. There's two boosters. There's the C plus resveratrol and the HA plus ceramide. When I use retinol, I cannot use the C plus resveratrol booster. Okay, so I'm gonna put that aside because I can't use it with the same night I'm using retinol. And we're gonna use retinol tonight. But I can use the, the HA plus ceramide. So right after cleansing, I put the H plus A ceramide booster on. So it's a little eyedropper, you know, so I put a little, you don't need a whole lot of this stuff, like two drops is plenty. And I put that all over my face. So that goes on before the retinol. Okay, I even go down my neck area with that. So I let that dry before I start the retinol. Remembered I left my eye cream in here, so let me get that out. Okay, all right. So as we're waiting for the HA plus ceramide to really sink into my skin before I put the retinol set on, this is the gold standard in anti-aging. This 
makes everything work better, okay? So it reverses aging, it prevents aging, it does everything. So if you have not added the retinol into your skincare routine, you might wanna do it. I do it four times a week. I do it Monday through Thursday, okay? So every, every night, Monday through Thursday, do the retinol. Comes in two separate steps. It's the pure retinol followed by the facial milk. And the reason that they do that is because retinol can be harsh on people's skin. So followed by the milk, it makes everything great. Mary Kay was brilliant when they uh, came out with their version of the retinol. Okay, so now I feel like that HA plus ceramide has sunk in. So we're gonna go ahead and put the retinol on. Now, here's what I do. <laughs> I'm just going to share with you. My right hand, I can see aging. My left hand, not so much. I'm not sure what the deal is with that. So I squirt the retinol on the back of my hand. One pump is all you need. That is all of the retinol you need. You don't need more than one pump. And I take that retinol and I dot it all, you know, across my forehead, on my cheeks, everywhere on my face, okay? And then that remaining retinol that's on my hand, I rub into the back of my hand because it helps, you know, you see the eight signs of aging on your hand. So that's why I do that. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and take that retinol and rub it into my skin. And this is like the gold standard in anti-aging. And this combined with the boosters, I'm telling you make a, a, such a difference in your skincare. Okay, so now my retinol's on and I dropped my uh, lid. So I'm just gonna wait again a couple seconds and then I'm gonna follow the retinol with the facial milk. That is, it's a calming sort of moisturizing to put on right after the um, retinol, okay? So I'm gonna just, again, you don't need a whole lot of this stuff. So one squirt is all you need and I put that all over. and down my neck. Now, if you noticed when I put the retinol on, where did I put the retinol? Right here. I did not put the pure retinol right on my neck, okay? I cannot use it on my neck. Most people can't use it on their neck because it's just a little bit too um, harsh for that skin around your neck. If you wanna try it, you can try to retinize your neck and use it, but you know what? I just recommend you keeping it on your face. But you did notice that when I used the facial milk, that residue of the retinol was still on my fingers. And so I went down my neck area because I could get a little bit of retinol on my neck area. So that's how I do things because remember, we see the signs of aging in our eyes and our neck. So I wanna make sure I take care of that area, okay? So that is my retinol step. And I do that four days a week, Monday through Thursday. Okay, and remember, I've added in the boosters. When I use my retinol, I don't use the C plus resveratrol. I only use the HA plus ceramide with my retinol. I know it seems confusing, but once you start doing this, it's a piece of cake, I promise. <laughs> remember, we have our skin forever, for a lifetime, so we need to make sure we take good care of it. Okay, so next up in the routine is I'm going back to the time-wise repair. So I added in, so I cleansed my face, I did the one booster, I did the retinol, and now I'm back to my regular skincare routine. We can't forget to finish up the skincare routine because remember the boosters boost the skincare routine, the retinol boosts what you're already using. Okay, so I am going to put the uh, lifting serum on. This stuff is amazing. You know, as we age, our skin starts to sag and this uh, lifting serum definitely uh, just sort of boosts everything. And so I put that all over my face. And again, down my neck area. And I tell people, up is young, down is old. So we always wanna go like in an upward motion, okay? All over your face. That is the lifting serum. Once again, one pump will be enough. And the other thing I like to do with the lifting serum, because that runs out the quickest, is make sure my fingers are a little bit damp so it goes on, I don't have to do more than one pump, okay? Makes sense? I try and try and get the, the most use out of our products. All right, so while I'm again, because I'm doing this rather quickly, letting it sort of sink in, I just wanna talk about the day and the night cream in the repair set. 
So of course the day cream is for the daytime and that is has SPF 30 in it. So it is great. Love this stuff and it really helps with the S. We need, we need SPF coverage even in the fall and the winter because the sun is out. So um, definitely love that. But it's nighttime, so we need to use our night cream. And our night cream has retinol in. And so you're probably thinking, Teresa, what is the difference between the pure retinol and the retinol in the night cream? I'm so glad you asked because here's the difference. This is pure retinol that you're putting on your skin. This in the night cream with retinol is encapsulated retinol. So it's, it's time releasing the retinol. So you're getting pure and then time release retinol, which, you know, we wanna take care of our skin. We want to age gracefully, okay? All right, now we're finishing up. So I'm gonna share again with you what, what I do that I absolutely love. So at night, I take my night cream, I add a drop of the Mary Kay Naturally Oil. As we start to mature, our skin starts to lose its um, moisture and hydration. So the more that you can hydrate the skin, the better, okay? So I love these containers. If you've never used the TimeWise Repair Set, it's an, air, it's an airless pump. So what that means is you're getting all the product out of here. So you literally, and I only do a half a pump. You pump it and it, see it squirts right out. Half a pump is all that you need, okay? So I have that retinol. make sure I get it all. And then I take my naturally oil in a dropper. One drop is all I need. Mix it together. And then I put it all over my face. Down my neck area. Oh, feels so good. And remember up is young, down is old. Now with the winter time coming, and our skin may be getting a little drier, I would highly recommend you getting a bottle of the Mary Kay Natural Light Oil, putting it in a drop into your nighttime moisturizer. It is so good. If you happen to be a little dry, you can actually put this in your daytime moisturizer. You can use this alone. It's like so versatile. I love this. You can use this on your cuticles. Like it's an amazing product. Okay. So last but not least, I wanna talk a little bit about the eye cream. I just am a little shocked sometimes that people don't use eye cream. The eyes are the first place we see the signs of aging. So we need a special cream for the eyes. Why? Because your eye is, the skin around your eyes is the thinnest skin on your body, okay? So it can be very sensitive and fragile. So you need a special kind of cream to take care of that. It's going to hydrate and it's gonna help with the fine lines and wrinkles. And so this is the, the best eye cream ever. It is our TimeWise Ren uh, Renewal Eye Cream in the repair set. I call this the beast because it does everything. So it moisturizes, it fights the fine lines and wrinkles, it helps with the darkness, helps with the puffiness, it does it all. And I love the applicator part of this too. That's a steel tip applicator, okay? So you're gonna just squirt a little bit. Again, a little bit of product is all you need. You don't need a, a ton of product. Squirt the product out and then literally just put it all over your eye. Now at nighttime, I definitely put it on my eyes because just like everything else, our eyes sag too. So I make sure I get around here and then the tops of my eyes. So I squirt a little more out and I do that. So I highly recommend that everybody use an eye cream. It makes such a difference. Okay, so there you have it, my nighttime skincare routine to turn back the hands of time. I promise you, it all starts with a good skincare routine. And we talked a little bit about the repair set. I use the repair set. Once you have a good skincare routine, then you can start adding things in. And so that's where the boosters come in. You can add the boosters in if you have a good skincare routine. The boosters can't boost if you're not using a good skincare routine, okay? So then you can add the boosters in. You, if you use the Miracle Set, you can still add the booster set into that. And then also, if you really want to turn back the hands of time and you really want to reverse the signs of aging, then you need to add the retinol in. Okay, that's the in retinol set with the pure retinol and the facial milk. Comes as a set, but then you can buy it separately because you're definitely gonna go through this quicker than this. This lasts me a year. 
like over a year and this um, probably like five to six months. So that will, it's the gold standard for anti-aging. All right, ladies. So don't forget to turn your clocks back on Saturday night. And um, when you're doing that, don't forget to turn back the hands of time by using a good skincare routine, adding in boosters and adding in pure retinol. Have a great night, everybody. See you later.